In this video, we will see how to create a user-friendly front-end user registration in WordPress and register users to your site using a custom WordPress user registration form. We will use Tablesome which is an user registration form add-on that helps to register users using popular WordPress form plugins. To create a custom user registration form you can make use of any of the WordPress form plugins supported by Tablesome that is Contact Form 7, WP Forms, Forminator, and Elementor plugins. First, we will see a creating a user registration form with Contact Form 7 free plugin. When creating a user, WordPress requires two obligatory fields, that is username and email, so your form should have them. You can see that I have a sample user registration form with some user profile fields other than the mandatory fields such as nickname, display name, etc., could be added. You could also create additional form fields like house address, phone number, zodiac sign, etc. These form fields can be stored as user metadata. After adding all the necessary form fields you could save the form. You could do the same with Elementor Page Builders, Elementor Form Widget with the basic text and text area fields. Also, you could use the WP Forms Lite popular free WordPress plugin to create a user registration form. Then there is the free Forminator plugin that you can use to create a user registration form. Now that the form is ready, let's go to Tablesome and create a user registration workflow. Give this workflow a good title. Under Workflows, you can see that all the supported forms are listed here. You will have Trigger 1 section, here you can select the CF7 integration. Then select the OnForm Submit, CF7, Trigger and select the User Registration form. You can do the same for other form plugin integrations. Then under Action 1, select the Action WordPress integration and then choose the Add User WordPress action you can enable or disable user notification email that will be sent to the form submitter. Below you will find the map user field section, here you can map the form field to the available user fields. Username, user email, and user role are the minimum necessary fields for a user to be created in WordPress. You can select the user role for the newly created user. You can also map other available user profile fields. If you have a custom user field you can store it as a user metadata with a meta key. After finishing the field mapping, you can save the workflow by clicking the save button. Now that we have created the user registration workflow. Let's submit a test form and see if a new user is being created.
Let's submit this form and check if the user is created. We can see that a new user is created on this WordPress site, using the custom front-end user registration form that we have created. Tablesome does not collect passwords. In order to use or set a password an email consisting of an auto-generated link will be sent to the users and users can set the password in the corresponding page. With Tablesome you can also set up workflows to redirect form submitters to another page, also save the form entries and much more. Like, comment and share this video. Subscribe to this channel to get more videos like this.